everybody. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Foxy and this is Foxy Books and Planning. Um, today I have my monthly sticker haul for y'all. I have two shops that are brand new to me to show you all for this January and I'm really excited so let's just jump into it. So the one on top was the shop that I had picked to be my featured shop for this month and that is um, Lulu's Daisies and Co. Um, they are out of Virginia, and I, this was one of the shops that I got a freebie from as part of my December um, haul, and one of the things that um, I really liked about it was that she had um, disinfect the house stickers, so I wanted to go and try and find those. I was also trying to find shops that had more usable boxes and icons because I found that I don't want that many kits anymore because one of my goals for this year is to do more Franken spreads and it's easier to do Franken spreads if I don't have as many kits coming in for me to use. So to start off with this, um, so I have a variety of boxes. Um, I did have a, um, what's the word I'm looking for? A mystery bag. Of bill stickers so it was a bill steam mystery bag with 11 sheets in it and then some items from my notes page and some headers so to start off with we have the freebie um, which is the same size as her last one and another really good selection of stickers these ones are all food themed but I really like especially like the crock pot meal or taco Tuesday I really like these stickers and I like how they're all in one color so you could use them across multiple spreads or all in one spread if you wanted to. And I might have to go back and see if I can find that crock pot meal sticker. So the first set, I'm going to set the mystery box, the mystery bag aside. Because I don't know what I'm getting in that, but I do know what these are. So to start with, I have some declutter boxes. Um, I am planning to do a declutter of my house this year. And I really wanted boxes so I could write what I'm decluttering and check it off when I'm done. Um, and this will probably go in the notes section of my weekly spread. But I'm really happy with these. I like the color. Um, and there's a good variety of colors as well. Then to go along with that, there's also organize boxes. For once I declutter things, I can then organize them or maybe organize something completely different. But also really excited to have these for my decluttering and whatnot for this year. And then this, I was really excited to see this because I find of all the headers I use, which I don't use that many headers, um, I use a lot of next weeks. And each kit only comes with one because you only need one next week in a weekly kit. So I was re I'm was i really happy to get these and these will make it a lot easier to do Franken spreads as well. So I'm not hunting so much for a next week header that doesn't exist. The next, these are a bunch of... Um, notes page stickers they're all one sticker per month and I think there's five of each so two three five one three all right so there's two kinds that I got I got the no spend monthly tracker that's just a, a big sticker of the days of the month and so I can color in each day I have a no spend um, kind of like a habit checker, but a much bigger version that'll work on the notes pages better. And to go along with that, there's also the mood this month so I can track my mood. Um, just to see if there's any patterns or whatnot with my moods. So those are the things that I ordered myself. Now this is my Bill's 11 sheet grab bag. I have no idea what's in these. And I'm hoping a lot of them are fun and usable. So the first one I have is the like house bills. So you have rent or mortgage, electric, auto insurance, auto loan, water bill, cable bill, phone bill, internet bill, life insurance, some random bill dues and some credit cards in kind of a pinky tealy magenta theme. And then we have the same sheet in kind of peaches and blues the same sheet in more of a summery one so orange and blues then we have pastel reds another pastel 
So the same pastel. Then a more fall one. Then a Halloween one. Another summer one again. Another pastel and then a bold. So it's 11 of the same sheet, just in different colorways, which I'm totally okay with. I like these stickers. I use these a lot in both my monthly and my weekly spreads. So I'm happy to have these. And I'm actually really excited. Apologies if you hear the blinds. I have the windows open because it is currently 70 degrees here in North Carolina. Um, but everything's on matte paper. It's all really nice. I like the printing. I like the color varieties. I like the quality of the sticker itself. I like the little freebie. It's a really great shop and I really recommend you all check her out because it's a smaller shop. I just, I wouldn't have known about her if I hadn't gotten the freebie in another shop's order, but I really like this shop and I'm probably going to be making another order in the near future. So my next one, my next order is from The Grateful Planner um, and she is out of Germany. So I just got this. I ordered this well, I think I ordered back on Black Friday maybe? It's been a really long time since I ordered. Um, but I knew it was going to take a long time since it was it was coming from Germany. So the, f what did I get? I got a kit. Yeah, a kit. A kit and then kind of a sampler page that can go with the kit. And then date covers and a freebie. Um, so to start with, we have, oh yeah, Black Friday week because I got the Black Week sampler. Um, so yeah, so it did take over a month, but it's totally okay. I get it if it's coming from abroad. I tend to not worry about things from abroad not showing up really quickly. So we have this little sampler, which has a baking full box, some quarter boxes, half boxes, and some little deco and some really cute little traveler's planners. Then I have the date covers that I bought to go with um, my kit. Now, I believe this is all vinyl. I'll check as I go. Um, I do know that I ordered premium matte, but it's these pretty little pinky floral kind of cherry blossom themed with silver foil, which are beautiful. And I like how each set of um, date covers has a different font. And then we have the sampler that I got, which is also vinyl in that same kind of cherry blossomy pattern. So there's some flags. Some big foiled icons, including a weekend banner, some little labeled flags, and then some hexagons and circles. And then this is the kit that I got to go with it. I think this is actually supposed to be a wedding kit, but I ordered it because I liked the florals and I liked the color scheme. So, because I don't have to use the wedding themed things if I don't want to. I can save them for a friend's wedding or whatever. So here are the full boxes. It is a very fall theme and these are on vinyl. Um, so yeah, these are, so it says never let go of your dreams and everything is in this kind of folly, pink, maroon, um, floral theme that I absolutely love. And then we have a whole page of boxes. Mostly we have half boxes and then quarter boxes. And I like the split because I tend to use more quarter boxes than full boxes. Then we have the washi page with some more flags. If you wanted to do like a flaggy weekend banner, you could do um, the week weekend flags as kind of a combination of these two and then put the weekend banner over top if you wanted. Um, also really nice in terms of the washi, even though the um, pattern is duplicated. And then we have just a pale pink, the um floral with the burgundy and then the floral with the pink then we have headers um habit trackers half checklist boxes and the actual checklists and there are actually three different colors of checklists and i like how she grouped the three together and they're scalloped which i also really like and then we have full heart check boxes with the weekly habit tracker weekly tracker whatever you want to call it and some header, some decorative headers. Again, I also really like these. I like how she took the time to put the white box over top so you can still write in them but still have the pretty pattern in the background. The same thing with the weekly box. 
And then we have the deco and icons. So there's some more flags at the top and a row of deco, a weekend banner that you could again layer over and then some beautiful floral deco and that wedding dress. I really like this kit, like really, really, really like it. I might save it for next fall, but it's a really beautiful kit and I'm really happy to have it. So that was all I have for January. Um, I don't have another shipment even done yet. Um, I'll have to figure out what shop I want to do for um, February. But with that, I will um, talk to you all in another video. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed this video. As always, please like and subscribe. Comment down below if you have any shops that you think I should check out, your thoughts about any of the stuff that I got. And if you're a shop that would like me to purchase something from you so I can look at it and give my thoughts, my first impressions on the channel, I'd be happy to just hit me up. Um, with that, I hope you'll have a wonderful rest of your day and I'll talk to you in another video. Bye.